in this video today we will see what to do if the app store can't download apps in your iphone or ipad let us start with the basic things the first thing that you have to do is you have to restart your iphone sometimes restarting the iphone fixes many of the minor issues now the next thing that you have to check is you have to make sure that there is good internet connection in your iphone so try to open websites or youtube videos and check if the internet is working properly or not if you are using mobile data then you can switch to wi-fi or else if you are using wi-fi then you can switch to mobile data and check if you can download the app or not now the other thing that you have to check is you have to see how much of space is left in your iphone or ipad go to settings go to general go to iphone storage and make sure that there is enough space in your iphone or ipad for me out of 64 gigabyte i have used only 35.6 gigabyte that means i have enough space left for applications to be downloaded and installed in my iphone if you don't have it then you need to make sure that you have space in your iphone or ipad now the other thing that you can do is you can restart downloading the app Suppose if any app is trying to download and if it is stuck, then you can pause the app and then restart the downloading process. Now the other thing that you can do is you can sign out of your Apple ID and then sign back again. So go to settings, tap on the name at the top here, scroll down and select this option sign out. Now you have to enter the password for your Apple ID and then turn off and then again sign out sign out now what you have done is you have signed out of the apple id after that again what you do tap on this option sign into your iphone enter your apple id next next now i have to enter the passcode for my iphone select merge so once you have signed out and sign it again after that what you do go to this app store tap on the profile at the top and here also you have to sign in by using your apple id enter the password sign in and once you have signed in try to check if you can download the application or not now the other thing that you have to check is you have to make sure that you have set correct date and time on your iphone so go to settings go to general go to date and time and make sure to enable this option set automatically so that date and time will be correct if your date and time is not correct in iphone or ipad then your device will not be connected to the internet properly now the last thing that you can do is you can reset your network settings go to settings here go to general go to transfer or reset iphone select reset and you have many options out of this one what you can do is you can select this option reset network settings and then you have to enter the passcode and if i select this option reset network settings what does it do is it will delete all the network settings related to wi-fi mobile data and it will go back to the factory default so if you have any problem with the network connection then it will be corrected and after you have done this one check if you can download the application from the app store or not so do all of these all things and hopefully it should fix the issue thank you for watching this video please like and share this video if you found it helpful also click on the subscribe button and hit on the bell icon to get the notification of our latest videos for free